But I want to spend a few moments and talk about the defense, especially the new look linebacking core. They are racing from sideline to sideline. They're getting to the quarterback and they're wrapping up the running backs. They are playing at a very high level. And a lot of that has to do with one new player who the Raiders traded for, linebacker Cameron Wembley. It was a rare off-season surprise that Cleveland Browns best pass rusher and 2006 first-round pick Cameron Wembley was traded to Oakland for a Raiders third-round pick in this season's draft, a transaction no one saw coming. I did not know about the trade. I actually drove from Florida back up to Ohio and I was getting ready to, to walk in for off-season workouts, off-season conditioning, and that's when I found out I was a Raider. Wembley was a key component to the Raiders' rebuilding of their linebacker core. He posted an impressive 26 and a half career sacks in four seasons with Cleveland, and Oakland was excited the playmaker would be donning the silver and black, and so was Wembley, literally. I think it's a sense of pride. I, I know that around the NFL, you know, you speak to other players on other teams, they love the uniforms, they love, you know, the silver and black. So, I mean, you always hear about that regardless of what NFL team you're on. I think I look good in it, to be honest, too. So, I mean, I like it. Number 96 wore his new colors with pride and made an immediate impact. During the Raiders' preseason game against the Bears, the fifth-year pro out of Florida State recorded four sacks in one half. That's the most sacks I've gotten in the NFL game, and it was all in one half. So I definitely think that some of the players were impressed and, and the coaches were impressed. And, you know, it feels good. I think my teammates already uh, felt like they could trust me as, as an impact player, and I think I was just given opportunity opportunity to show them that. And Wembley picks up the sack on Kyle Orton. It is a Raiders silver and black avalanche here in the Rocky Mountains. As an outside linebacker, Wembley's transition to a new defense has appeared seamless. Knowing a few familiar football faces has helped. Some of the guys I actually played with in Cleveland, uh, Greg Kowski was over there, my coach, Mike Kalachek, Charlie Fry was over there. He's a quiet guy, but he plays with a lot of energy, a lot of aggressive, and uh, he, he's a leader by example. Wembley's instant ease with Oakland and his successful start to the season have enabled him to try new things during his downtime. This season, he's taking a test run with Twitter, a gesture for the newcomer to become familiar with the Raider Nation, a fan base like no other. The Oakland Raider fans are just so phenomenal. They're behind this team. Uh, they just want to encourage us and see us do well, and, you know, I'm really happy to have that here. With five sacks to his credit as a Raider so far this season, Wembley is tied for the team lead alongside defensive end Matt Shaughnessy. He's raising our pass rush to another level, and I think it's a great combination with him and Trevor Shaughnessy. You know, all those guys seem to really be impacting. It's a good thing going on right now. I think they're really starting to feel each other and, and get a feel for each other in terms of some of the stunts and things that we're running and it's a nice mix and make no mistake the third down pass rushing specialist has crushing quarterbacks at the top of his Sunday agenda really I would say I'm addicted to sex definitely it's like you need to get them after you get one <laughs>